Yeah. So we need to start something on the controlling part. Okay. okay. If we come to the MS Paint button, we'll understand some things first theoretically, then we'll go into the SAP system. Okay. Yeah. Now our objective in FI was to generate okay. it. Profit and loss and balance. Okay. <clears throat> so this is something which gives us the overall picture of the <clears throat> organization. How the whole company is performing. If you want to know, you have to depend on the profit and loss account and the balance sheet. Okay. okay. But the top management cannot take all the decisions only based on the profit and loss account and balance sheet. They need some okay. extra information. So such additional okay. information they will be generating it from the CO side, which is your controlling. And in general terminology, this is your costing or what we call as management accounting. Purposes. Okay. Yeah. This is something which is required for internal decision making. Based on the reports, the top management can take some kind of decision which is required for the internal purpose. Okay. Okay, yeah. Mm. Now, FI, all our activities we have recorded for the company code. Okay, yeah. CO, we have to create a controlling area. Okay. So, we'll create a controlling area, and under this controlling area, we'll be creating one cost center standard hierarchy. So I'll, I'll just okay. the name. You can put the name of the company code also, but to have a slight difference between the company code, the controlling area, I'll give the hierarchy as the name of our company code GLST and I'll say HIER. Now why we have okay. created yeah. this hierarchy is under this hierarchy, we can create yeah. different cost centers, different departments can be created. Let's say if I want to create okay. something like department A, department B, Department C, where I want to see how this department has been performing, or what is the expenditure yes. which we have incurred for this particular department. In such a case, we yes. have to compulsory go hmm. to the creation of this hierarchy. Now, once okay. we create yes. hierarchy, this controlling area, okay. we have to assign it to the company code. Oh, okay. <coughs> the reason why we have to assign it is. The flow of transaction okay. will always be from FI to CO. So we have to once again post the transaction in FI only. The only thing is for our okay. internal requirement, the system will generate some reports which has to be posted from FI. Okay. 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 We'll go ahead with the creation of the controlling area first. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let me come back to SPRO. Okay. So we'll come to controlling. Yeah. General controlling. Yeah. Organization and maintain controlling area. Okay. Transaction code here is OKKP. So double click on maintain controlling area. Okay. So passive. So we are coming here, we will go to new entries. Give the control here, the name we will give it as GLST. This will call us controlling area for GLST. The person responsible is not required. Now here we will go with controlling area same as company code. 
the moment I specify this currency type, the currency, the chart of accounts and the fiscal year variant will get displayed automatically. So I'll just click the drop down. So here we have 10, that is company code currency, it comes by default. So the moment I give yeah, so, so you get yeah, I think again your voice was breaking. Is the screen visible to you? Okay. Uh, Venkat, can you hear me? Yeah, now I'm able to hear you. I think you were disconnected in between. Yeah, because I, I don't know why my, my net is going like that. Um, it just keep on disconnecting and connecting back again. Okay. Maybe today there's some problem. The other day it was not the, the case actually. Yeah, it's keep on discount. I think it's my internet problem. I don't know why my net is keep on dropping and connecting back again. Okay. I think this caller one is you only? I don't know. I don't know. Who else is joining caller one? I don't know who's that. I think by, by chance, did you re log in? No, it just because the networks keep on discounting and counting and just it, it just logged in again, I think. I'm not sure. I, mean, I do one thing in that case. Let me just uh, Shall I leave? dismiss this call yeah. and see. Okay, yeah. So you're able to hear me now? Hello? Are you able to hear me? So now you are able to hear me? Uh, hello, Venkat. Yeah, yeah, Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, I'm able to hear you. Are you able to hear me now? Um, Venkat, I, I, I can't hear you, Venkat. It's just disconnecting automatically. Okay. Is it okay now? Are you able to hear me now? Let me drop a message. I can't hear you, Venkat. We have defined this, we have given a name to our controlling video. There is the same name okay, which we have yeah. given to our company code that we have specified. And there is a description. Okay, yeah. And here we selected controlling area same as company code. And the currency yeah. type, this is already predefined. I am just clicking the drop down. And the moment okay. I double click on that, the currency, the chart okay. of accounts and the fiscal year variant will get displayed automatically. So oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Mm. You see that all the three have come automatically. Here, yes, okay, yeah. I'll give the hierarchy as underscore H I E R. So you can give the name of the company code also just to have some differentiation between the hierarchy and the controlling area. I have given that underscore H I E R. Okay. Save it. Okay, yeah. So it says hierarchy does not exist. Do you want to create it? And say yes. Okay. Go to our request. Okay. Now this controlling area 
we will assign it to the company code. Double click on assignment of company codes. New entries. And here, I'll give the company code. Save it. Okay. So we go to activate components slash control indicators. Double click on that. Mm -hmm. If new entries. Okay. Now, what are all the things which are required for us in the CO side that we are trying to activate here? The fiscal year, we go with the year 2018. We need cost centers. That's why we'll make the cost centers as component active. We need to record activities to the cost centers. That's why we'll make. Sorry, Venkat, your, your voice is breaking again. Sorry, Venkat, your voice is breaking again. Okay. How is it now? Any change? Uh, I can hear you, but you know it's not the continuous one. It, it's just breaking, and but I can I can hear you what you are saying, but it's keep on breaking. Okay, I don't know what's the problem actually. Because things are okay from this side. Don't know exactly. <coughs> yeah. In, in between, it just keep, uh, there is a pause, and then I can hear you. There is a pause, and then I can hear you. Okay. There must be some problem with the network only. Okay. Uh, any change? How is it now? Yeah, my... Yes, yeah, still it's breaking, Venkat. Sorry. Okay, I'll do one thing. I'll just log out and log in again. Let's see whether it works or not. Okay. Yeah. Yeah.